Hello, this is Mr. Agbamu Idono Grenier. I'm here to show you how you can install the software FX software which I usually use in my mathematics class to type equations and to draw some geometric diagrams easily without stress using the Microsoft Word. And this is the link I created a drive Google Drive I created just get this link in your in the description of this video just go down to the description of this video you will see this link click on it and follow the link you will see the download link and you will install it from there or you can just simply copy it like the way I have it here just copy the link as you copy it then you paste it in your browser just paste it all through like this then you follow the link just make sure you have internet connection in your system all right so it's going now you can see it fx software is loading so it will come up like this when you click on the link or you paste it on your browser if you open like this then you see download just click on download and just move on then download anyway see 79 MB just click on it yes so it's going now okay, now you can see it's downloading now so FX software you get the file in display when it's finished downloading all you just need to do you open this rar file and move on all right so let me stop this because i already have it in my system i don't need to re-download it again let me cancel it okay so when you are true in downloading the fx software you go to your folder where you saved it so i've already saved it in a folder here so this is it here so I've already saved it in this folder. All you need to do now is to um, open the file. Let's right click. You extract to FX software. Then we ask for a password. Just type 123. So you can see the password is 123. Then it's OK. And that is all. So when you do that, the next thing is to open the folder, just double click, it opens, then double click again, then this is the uh, setup there, right click, you run as administrator, tell it yes, then you move from there, you follow the step, very easy to install, just follow all the necessary steps, accept, next, next, and that is all when you click on next you will just install it in your system see so to continue click next and that is all since i've already installed it so i don't need to click on next so i'll just stop here so you click on next install it in your system and you get the fx full software in your system and that is all about the downloading and installing of the fx draw then when you are through with that you come to this crack you copy all this copy all this you copy this under crack you copy these four tools you can see the four tools we have in the fx software the draw the equation the graph and the statistics they are four so after copying it go to your system where you install it let me minimize this so you see my fx equation just go to where you save it just right click go to open file location you right click on fx equation open file location then in this place you paste then just click on ctrl v she's telling me to replace the file in the destination so you just say replace file so as you click on replace file and that is all it's because i already have it here that's why it's telling me to replace so we just control paste then replace all the file and you are good to go so continue 
and that is that so we have it in our system and we are good to go so you can see it here this is fx equation this is fx draw so anyone you want to work with this is graph this is start you go like that so let me open the equation and the draw so that you can see it and that is it okay yeah so this is the equation fs equation it has opened then you can start typing your equation the way you want it x squared plus 3x minus 4 equals to 0 you can see it just like that and this is the output why this is your input just type the equation you want maybe a quadratic formula you want to type it just say x equals to minus b plus or minus let me uh, maximize it so that you can see the output. See it plus or minus square root sr. Then you put the value b square minus 4 is. See the square did not cover up. That means I need to put b square in a bracket. Yes. Then close the bracket here. You can see then since I wanted to give denominator open the bracket here then close the bracket here before you press over 2a so you can see so you have the equation easily then you copy here copy the equation paste it in your word anywhere you want to use it so that is it then for the draw this the draw tools so you have it in your system then you are good to go. You have your FX a software in your system. Use it anytime you want. Draw any tool you want to draw. This is a rectangle. Just click and drag just like that. There your circle. And that is that. So in my next video, I will show you how to use this in some of your works. Alright, so that is how to... <coughs> install fx software in your system then if you want to get it into your microsoft Word, you may want to integrate it into your microsoft Word so that instead of opening it here and keep copying and pasting why not just do it inside your microsoft Word? so you go to microsoft word you open your microsoft word in your system let's open it and see So you see my Microsoft Word, if you look at all the icons here, you see there's no FX2 here. So I can't work with FX2 now. So to do that, you close your Microsoft Word, go to the FX equation or any of them, you just open, go to help, click on help, go to manage office integration, click on it, then you will see multi-doc modem mode just click on this then okay that is all they will write office integration updated successfully so you have it in your microsoft or okay then you can now open your microsoft for now you will see it fx software tool will appear in your microsoft for then you can work from there do your work and you will enjoy yourself so you can now see it fx software is there now so just click on fx you can see all of them this fx draw fx draw fx equation so statistics is not open graph is not open that's why it's not highlighted then we have other ones like the chemistry structural and form of an organic chemistry and the rest they're all there so let me work on draw for example let's say you have a mathematics diagram geometry diagram you want to do in your class or you are preparing question for your student anything you wish to do as a mathematics teacher just click on the draw from fx draw click on the draw so it will take you there then you can do whatever you want let's say let me just do a simple circle geometry question i have a question something like this okay Let's undo this. Okay. 
if the thickness is not large enough you can just highlight you can increase the thickness of the lines let me see so you can increase the thickness let me take it to 1.25 okay i think this is okay so you can get the thickness from here you can change the kind of lines but i like it first just like that see but i need thick lines so whatever you want to do is all left for you to choose so when you are through hit this button it will take you to your microsoft and your diagram will be J. So, so quick and fast, position it anywhere you want in your work and you are good to go. So this is how you can install FX software into your system, then integrate it into your Microsoft Word and that is all with that. So that is all I have for us in this video. I hope you enjoy this video, I hope you like it. You can use FX tool in your work as a mathematics teacher or even as a student of mathematics to create simple and quick equation and quick diagrams in Microsoft Word in your work in school. So that is all for now. Thank you for watching. Do have a nice day.